foot, good, lift your knee up, and your foot, and lift your knee, and your foot. Good, and let's switch over to the other leg one more time. I just want to show you on video how different it is. Careful with that lift, use your stomach muscles, good, okay, now lift your foot first, your right foot, push, okay, you lifted your knee, yeah, lift your foot, yeah, good, there you go, now push your foot on the ground, and lift your knee up, there you go, it's already getting better, good, now lift your foot, and lift your knee, good, and foot, and knee, good, and bring your left side back up again, Left side? Yeah, right side down, left side up, left hip. Oh, left hip? Yeah, bring your right foot down, and then now bring your left hip up again. All right, now this time put your left hand behind your head, and now rotate up your left shoulder blade, and that's it, good, that's it. Keep your head mostly on your, on your uh, forearm. Just twist your upper back, good, and then bring it down, good, and lift. That's it, good, and down, and lift, good, and then switch uh, arms, put your right hand behind your head, but keep your legs there, same leg, good, and now rotate up. So you, after you do your leg rotations, you're going to do this little right and left side okay. upper back rotation, and it'll always be harder, you know, with the opposite arm and leg, yeah, yeah. and then rotate up, good, that'll feel tighter, but can notice that how much higher this side rotates than the other side. Mm -hmm. You know, when you had your right leg up, you could barely lift your left side, right? Yeah. And it is harder, you know, than when it's on the same side, but you always want to get symmetry between mm -hmm. the two sides.